Round 11 saw sixth placed Gloucester Hartbury make the trip up north to Corpac Stadium to face Sail Sharks, occupying the ninth spot in the Allianz Premier 15s. Just three points separated these two sides the last time they met, and the first 15 minutes here were a territorial tussle before Gloucester Hartbury ended the stalemate. Bryony King muscled over to finish off a series of pick and goes beneath the posts, and Daisy Farhe added the extras. The Cherry and Whites adapted to increasingly greasy conditions in Manchester, keeping things simple and physical off a 34th minute line out, and executing an unstoppable rolling ball. It was Welsh international Kelsey Jones who came up with the ball before handing it to Farhe, who was on the money again. 14-0 to the visitors at the halfway mark. It was to be a trio of unanswered scores for Sean Lynn's side, who emerged from the dressing rooms firing, and a first backs try as winger Ellie Underwood charged down Katie Daly McLean's attempted clearance to dot down. Fahe made it three from three, and Sail Sharks had it all to do. As the rain eased off, the pace of the game picked up, and possession changed hands more rapidly. Never more so than at 64 minutes, when Wells's Lisa Newman spotted a vulnerable pass, plucked the intercept and scorched her way onto the score sheet. Daly McLean coolly slotted the conversion to narrow the gap. Gloucester Hartbury went hunting for the bonus point, and after their forwards were held up twice over the line, Bianca Blackburn delivered, diving over the whitewash in the dying seconds of the match. The scrum half's pirouetting effort saw this fixture end 26 to seven. And the visitors who take on defending champion Saracens next week made the long trip home with maximum points in the bag.